Hi folks, welcome to GeoTalks. We're here at Biscuit Basin. Biscuit Basin is noted for the formations of silica uh, or geyserite on the edges surrounding the, particularly this pool here, Sapphire Pool. You can see the formations look a little bit like biscuits. And to some extent, they've kind of grown back. In 1959, there was a very powerful earthquake, about 7.3 on the Richter scale west of here and it destroyed the movement, the fracturing in the earth, destroyed all of these biscuits here. So for a long time, it didn't make sense. What is Biscuit Basin? But they are starting to grow back. Now, this pool here is a very, very hot alkaline pool. You can tell there's nothing growing in the center of this thing. It's too hot, it's boiling temperature. Uh, the blue color you see is really a reflection of the sunlight on the geyserite and the water. And if you move outward from the pool, you'll notice that the, there are colors. Those are the cyanobacteria, and they're living in approximately 117 to 89 degrees Fahrenheit. Uh, and they're all communities. They love the hot water, uh, but they don't love it too hot. And uh, another way you can tell an alkaline pool is you don't have the stink of sulfur. Sulfur would characterize more of the acidic pools. This is an alkaline pool with beautiful geyserite formations. That's the white stuff. And it's carried in the water and then deposited on the surface. 